Hey guys, this is a video for reverse bench flies. Let me show you the movement. We'll go through the mechanics and point of performance afterwards. So set yourself here. Bench uh, dumbbells are just below me, always there. I'm gonna grab them. The first thing that I'm going to do is retract my shoulder blades. Good. I'm gonna keep them there. Bells are facing each other. Up, and as you will see at the top, bells are parallel to my body, shoulder blades are in place, I'm gonna try to not let this happen, I'm always here, no, okay, good, that is it, that is our reverse bench fly, now let's go through the points of performance and why we want it like this, so I'm starting here, thumbs are pointing in, this is internal rotation of the shoulder, and I'm going here, Point, uh, thumbs are pointing up, that is external rotation of the shoulder, what we're teaching your body is how to move the arm in this range of motion without compromising the spine or the shoulder position we are like rounding up or really flaring that chest up right that's what we're teaching and also in this rotation here you get this muscle to work more which is what we want so that the muscles of the scapula don't have to compensate the shoulder doesn't have to compensate because everything is in a nice place right that is it uh, so again, let me show you one more rep. Uh, this setup is crazy, but uh, it's easy to do. You know, a box and a bench. If you don't find a box, you can do a stack of plates. People at the gym is gonna look you like, what the fuck are you doing? And you're gonna be like, oh, I got this. One told me this shit was cool. Uh, you shouldn't trust me on what's cool. But uh, yeah, let's do it. So last few reps here, belts are under me. I'm gonna set up my chest here, good support. Then I grab my bells, retract my shoulder blades. Thumbs are pointing to each other. Up, keep those shoulder blades in place. Up, keep those shoulder blades in place. Up, keep those shoulder blades in place. Up, there you go. As you saw there, in the last one I compensated a little bit going to chest up. So, the next reps I will control more of that. Uh, as soon as I notice, and if I couldn't, I would just deload a little bit on the weights. Uh, that is it. Reverse bench class.